on television before. Isn't there, Melanie Stan? <laughs> because back in 1992, <laughs> yeah, you and your best friend, Yvette Holden, were on the Tea Time Quiz Show <laughs> Blockbuster! <laughs> Hold on. Back then, back then, you were known as Melanie Godfrey, but it didn't go very well, did it, Melanie? <laughs> no, no. Should we see how she got on? <laughs> Take a look at this. Let's meet, shall we? Yvette and Melanie. There they are. <laughs> what I is a European member of the G7 group? Melanie. Ireland? No. <laughs> what D goes after white? Red and yellow. That's Rachel. Dwarf. Dwarf is right, yes. Well answered. Dwarf. Rachel. Tartan. Uranus. <laughs> Fox top. <laughs> Unemployed. That's the one. Unemployed is one. Ah, oh, hold on, hold on. You are whitewashed. What <laughs> went on there? You and Yvette left with just a tenner between you. And the girl who went on to one, went on to win a scuba diving holiday in Greece and £300. I bet you'd have something to say to her now, if you met her now, wouldn't you? Eh? Oh, yeah, I would. Well, you can't because she's here. Hi, you're here today. <laughs> Hi, how are you doing? Was well, it a nice holiday? Nice, lovely scuba diving holiday. Well, listen. Tonight, of course, you we're not we're not interested in winners because we want losers like you, Melanie. Tonight, that's what we're <laughs> you've had to live with your shame for 12 years. But no, tonight, no. we're going to give you a second chance to write a TV wrong as we roll back the years. Give me your hand and play once more. Blockbusters! <laughs> Welcome to a very special edition of Blockbusters. I can't believe I'm presenting Blockbusters. It's a dream come true. How cool is this? It's time to welcome our contestants for today. First up, representing Hillcrest Secondary School in Birmingham, please welcome Melanie Stans. <laughs> Joining Melanie tonight, her original Blockbusters partner, who she hasn't seen in eight years, Yvette Holden. Oh A great meeting of minds once again. <laughs> now, Melanie, we already know Rachel up there can absolutely wipe the floor with you, so <laughs> to give you a chance for tonight, your opponent, representing Rutherford Comprehensive School, Newcastle upon Tyne, it's Aunt McPartland. <laughs> Welcome, Aunt. Welcome, Hi, girls. Hi, girls. <laughs> <laughs> now, on the board, we have 12 hexagons. If Melanie and Vet get a question right, they'll turn a hexagon blue. If Anne gets a question right, it'll turn white. The first to complete a line on the board in their colour goes on to play in the gold run. And just like back in 1992, each correct answer is worth a staggering... five pounds. <laughs> if we take a look at the board, we can see the letter R is flashing, so I've always wanted to say this. Let's play Blockbusters. <laughs> Then fingers on buzzers. What are <laughs> rhubarb? <laughs> you really should listen to the question, Anne, because you're frozen out now. And I'll offer it to the girls. Girls, what are is the colour of a British post box? <laughs> Melanie. Red. Yes, it is red. <laughs> That's the correct answer. That's very, very good. I don't know how you lost all those years ago. You're very good at this. I know. <laughs> Pick a letter for me. Oh, sorry, P, please. Would you like the P? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, please. OK. What P? Paul Daniels? No, it's not Paul Daniels. I haven't asked the question yet. Oh, you should right. listen to the question. Have I frozen out? You're frozen out. <laughs> what P is a small green vegetable that you would find in a pod? <laughs> Melanie. P. It is a P. <laughs> Pick another letter, Melanie. Um, K, please. What would you like, K? OK, all right, the figures on buzzers, buzzers, good luck. What K? Niggas! No! Noggers! No! Niggas! No! no. no. <laughs> Just wait, I haven't asked the question yet. I'm frozen out. You're frozen out. I'm frozen out. This one of the girls. <laughs> what K would you boil water in? 
Melanie. A cattle. Very good, Melanie. <laughs> I, don't know, I don't know how you ever lost. I don't know how you lost. No. Very good. Now we can see your flash in there. Well, this two, this two, uh, <laughs> this two complete blockbusters. What do you want to go for, Melanie? A you, please. A you. Do you want you? Yes, please. What you? Uranus. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not Uranus, and you're frozen Jordan. out for the rest of the question. Out again. <laughs> what do you think about that? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What you would protect you from the rain? <laughs> Melanie. An umbrella. And that's blockbusters. <laughs> Nobody goes away empty handed because he gets our fabulous blockbusters dictionary and shirt. There it is. <laughs> so, Melanie, you're going through now to play in the gold run, but I can't do this. Oh, I'm not no. worthy. Please welcome someone with a little bit more experience, no. ladies and gentlemen. No. Show your appreciation for the one and only Mr. Bob no. Holders! <laughs> It's great to have you. Ah. 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 What an audience. It's lovely to see you. Fantastic. They're good, aren't they? Yeah, they're very good. Lovely to have you here. Thank you. It's wonderful to be here. Thank you very much. It's an honour. Would you do me a favour, Bob? Would you say the magic words for us? Right. <laughs> Melanie. Would you put yourself on the hotspot, please? <laughs> OK, Melanie, all you have to do to get from gold to gold in 90 seconds or less for tonight's very special Gold Run Prize. Are you ready? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, you are. Your 90 seconds start now. Now, which S-I is the name of the Cornish town where you did a number two in the rock pool? St. <laughs> 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 so Ives! St. So Ives is right. Is it? Right. Uh, CK. 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 What oh CK did goodness. you throw at your twin sister? Giving you the nickname the Evil Twin. A carving knife. Carving knife. <laughs> MU, please, Bob. M -U. Okay, MU it is. What MU did you once steal from oh a high street goodness. store <laughs> as a 15 year old, justifying this as a political statement? Makeup, Bob. Makeup is right. <laughs> yeah. When you were 11 years old, what TB did you accidentally... Oh, no. <laughs> ..accidentally <laughs> flash at a boy you liked at school disco? Training bra! Training bra! <laughs> <laughs> MS, please, Bob. MS, did you say? Yeah. Right. What MS is the name of your husband who loves you more than life itself and is, is very I? sorry for setting you up tonight. <laughs> Martin Stand. Martin Stand! <laughs> well done. Congratulations, Melanie. Thank You've you. won tonight's star prize. Congratulations, you're off to Greece, the home of Plato, Socrates and Moussaka. But don't worry, you won't just be taking part in the traditional smashing of plates all week, cos you're going scuba diving. Uncover the myths and legends that lie beneath the seas of ancient Greece as you stuff your face with seafood. Mm -hmm. And watch donkeys take old ladies for walks. You happy with that? I'm really happy Good. with that, Good. Fantastic. You. you came here tonight a loser, but you're leaving a winner. Ladies and gentlemen, give her a big hand. Melanie Stand! <laughs> and your host, Bob Holness! <laughs> oh, absolutely fantastic. Come here, you two. Stand up, <laughs> bitch.
But when we return, find out what these two are getting up to on Coronation Street. See you soon. I said, I said, they want our sausages. <laughs>